We've been talking us through the events of the last few days with a few players, JJ, Martin, Lockie Hunter, you know, in and out of the team. Melbourne was similar as well. Is that just normal round one preparation to you know, be uncertain, I guess, of how you're going to prepare? You've got the nerve to ask me a question and even be here. So you've been preying on us the last two times. You barracked for Melbourne, Tom Morris. Been preying on us. You've been opening us up, causing turmoil within our football club by declaring our team um, well before it needs to be declared. Is that the way Fox want you to oper operate? Yeah, is that what you're doing? Is that the gutter journalist you want to be? No. Is that, is that who you want to be? You let me answer, right? so, yep. so we went in with a plan. We had, we had some late stuff go on with JJ, um, unfortunately, coming out in the warm-up. Everything other than that was according to pl plan from the Sunday, which somehow you've found out about again. So we need to get to the bottom of this. Obviously, we need to put our hand up and, and say that there's, uh, there's some leakage going on, but you're preying on it. And, and it's a team you barrack for. Your conflict of interest here is considerable. And yet your gutter journalism at the moment is killing our, us and behind the scenes. This is why the health and well-being of people in the game is caught up in all this stuff, you know, because we've got things to concentrate performance -wise, concentrate on performance-wise. We've got to look after our own. And then you cause all this uh, muckraking trash that happens behind the scenes and names get brought up into it. And all we're doing is planning for a football game. I can't, are you proud of yourself? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, you're proud of yourself? Yeah, Fox backs me. Wow. Well, and to be honest, to be honest. Today. No, 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 that's enough. That's enough. Next question, please. Um, yeah, next question. You, you, mate, you, you're not welcome. No, no, this is the AFL's press conference, and I'll it's sit what? here. It's the what? It's the AFL's press conference. Yeah, OK. Well, well I think you've got enough boys and girls. For the next question. You got, I think we're probably done, aren't we? OK, so this is what happens, because I know, um, and I know Sam Edmund does it, you know, I know many of you, right, I know you'd do it. If you found something out, you'd ring Adrian Shed and say, look, I know this, just so you, you, you know that I know. Um, something's happened, it's got out, and the courtesy and the integrity uh, and the ethical way to go about it has happened in the past. Now, this bloke here, and what he's doing, he's given everyone else a bad name, you know, and, and right where we're trying to stabilise our competition and what we do with everything that's gone behind the scenes, and us, you know, as coaches and a football program, um, with this, the soft cap situation as it is, and, and this sort of stuff happens. You're an embarrassment to what you do, mate. No, You're an embarrassment. An absolute embarrassment. If you disagree, you won't get many friends.